I'm, I'm 32 and my boyfriend is 40. So it's, it's pretty cool dating an older guy. Because, like, we live together, and what's fun is that when they're older like that, you don't catch them jerking off. Because <laughs> they're not doing it. <laughs> like, like, somebody was like, oh, Ariel, are you worried about your boyfriend cheating on you? And I was like, cheating on me? With what? <laughs> she, no, I made that dude come yesterday. <laughs> He's not going to have another bullet at the chamber till Monday. <laughs> The other night we were going to bed and he was wearing these sweatpants and he was like, oh, it's a little too hot for these sweatpants. Takes them off, nothing underneath, <laughs> nothing. And then he starts to get into bed and I was like, no. <laughs> I don't know what it is. I just, I fully believe that if he goes to bed naked, he will shit the bed. <laughs> If I share a bathroom with him. You don't know what I know. Okay? I heard him the other day. I heard him. I heard him take a shit so intense. I swear to God. I swear to God, he went through the five stages of grief. I, like, there was, like, bargaining. He's like, I'll do this. <laughs> yeah, there was anger and depression on my part mostly. But <laughs> acceptance, you know, acceptance is like, fuck, I'm 40, and I was like, I'm doing the best I can. <laughs> That's real acceptance, right? <laughs> You'll get there. <laughs> it's something to look forward to. <laughs> no, it's uh, it's good, it's good. He actually he uh, he got me the softest blanket in the world. For my for uh, uh, Hanukkah earlier last year, I'm a Jew. It's <laughs> Do you have the best? The, like it's fleece and velvet. It's a like it's so soft it almost made me want to stop cheating on him. other girls. Any, anyone else with glasses and a ponytail? No? <laughs> I used to think I was not like other girls, and then my boyfriend hinted that for my birthday this year, my present might be an engagement ring. Ooh. I know. I was like, oh, I'm exactly like other girls. <laughs> you know, because if he thinks that he's going to get out of getting me a real birthday present, <laughs> if he did ever cheat on me, I do have a plan. So my boyfriend, he's a big Chicago sports guy. Where are my Chicago sports fans? Make some noise. Yeah. 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 We are in a nonprofit arts organization. Yeah. Me neither, but I do it for the bit. So, so he's a big Chicago sports fan. He's a big Chicago football fan, specifically Chicago Bears fan. Yeah. So if he cheated on me, who would I date to get back at him? Packers. Great guess, great guess. Green Bay Packers is a great guess, but no. I would date Justin Fields. <laughs> For those of you who don't know, no. Justin Fields is the current quarterback of the Chicago Bears. He is a freak show athlete, okay? He is going to take the Bears from their decades of loser them up to that Super Bowl day in the future, am I right? Woo! Yeah. Thank you for trying. <laughs> boyfriend tells me. I really don't pay enough attention. He uses the royal we too. He's like, we got the number one draft pick. I'm like, you're not on the team. <laughs> no, but I would say Jessica, and I would make him love me, okay? Like, my love will be what propels the Bears to that Super Bowl day, and on that day, I will dump him. <laughs> I will break his heart, okay? I will 
ruin my boyfriend's favorite franchise <laughs> if he were to cheat on me. And I'd do it while wearing a piss. 